the 300 tread wear, so they should last me a little while. Depends on how crazy I go. What, you don't drive crazy though. No, no. It's not like you're doing smoky burnouts or anything never, all the time. juice m juice what's up everyone welcome to today's video it's been a long winter the e90 m3 is gonna get her her spring shoes on today it's an exciting day so our good friends at apex race parts sent me some nice new wheels in that box over there let's see them we give it away let's see them yes of course before i give it away i want to show you guys that we're a big fan of Apex wheels here. Look at Quinn's been rocking these EC7s on the Z4 M Coupe for quite some time now. They've seen a lot of street and track use and abuse, and they're still looking good. They're a little dirty, a little bit of brake dust, but that's on I mean, Quinn. Yeah, it's on Quinn. He drives. He drives his cars. <laughs> All right, let's let's open the box. See what we got here. Easy, nice and easy. So I took a, I did a poll on Instagram to see should I do EC7s or ARC8s. It was almost 50/50, but there's something about these that I really, really liked. What do you think, Matthew? I love them. What I love about these. These are the Apex ARC8s in 19 by 10 and a half, plus 22 in the rear. And the fronts, I'm gonna do 19 by 10, plus 25, I believe it is. Um, what I love about these the most, besides the hyper silver color, I think it's gonna look good on a white car. I like the concavity. If you look at it from the side profile, it's just oh, yeah. so concave. That is a beautiful wheel. I'm gonna go into all the features of this wheel, but right off the bat, what I love about it, the concavity I already mentioned, the apex center caps are really nice, I do like them, but I love that you can put the BMW, the OEM center caps in there. And to the untrained eye, people would think it's like an OEM plus style wheel. Also got some thick meats, which I'll talk about in more detail, but they're 295, 30, 19 Michelin Pilot Sport 4 S's. They look awesome. I've heard a lot of good reviews about this tire. I haven't tried them yet personally, but the 300 tread wear, so they should last me a little while. Depends on how crazy I go. What, you don't drive crazy though. No, no. It's not like you're doing smoky burnouts or anything Never. all the time. <laughs> we'll see how long these last. All right. Do, 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 do. Are you focused, Shannon? Are you focused? Keep it. All right, so I am back at home base here, and I want to go over a few of the reasons why I chose these wheels specifically, and why I think it's a perfect balance between a track and a street setup. So, Apex Race Parts, when they're designing their wheel, they design it specifically for each vehicle, and they take everything into account. Number one reason I chose this wheel, fitment is on point. I mean, in every way possible. So, in one way, most important way, 
The 19 by 10 and a halfs are perfect fitment for the rear, fills out the rear arches perfectly. And the 19 by 10s that I'm putting in the front are also just about as wide as you want to go with the 275 tire in front. Um, I have, these are profile three, which is the deepest concavity, which in my opinion looks the best, but I mean, uh, maybe a little bit biased. But that's, that's one thing that I love about these wheels. Another cool design feature that Apex took into account was the open hub center design. So, say you're at a local racetrack and you need to swap out your wheels and tires, get your big fat impact socket in there and swap it out no problem without risking scratching your wheels up or anything like that. Um, it's also hub centric. No need for hub rings, direct bolt on, good to go. Also, this part I really love. You can fit the OEM Rondo, 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 BMW center caps. They go right in here. I'll show you. You could either use your apex caps, the plastic's still on there. They come with it. Or what I'm gonna do is put the OEM BMW caps on there. So like I said in the beginning, it's gonna be like an OEM plus look, but very aggressive. I think it's gonna look perfect. These wheels are also pretty light, despite how large they are, especially for E90 M3 fitment. So the 19 by 10 and a half weigh in at 22.95 pounds, and the fronts, which are 19 by 10s, are just one pound less at 21.95 pounds. All Apex Race Parts wheels comply with JWL standards and are certified by the VIA. You may have just heard that and been like, what are you talking about? Let me explain. Basically, what it comes down to is, Japan has stricter regulations than the USA does. JWL stands for Japan Light Alloy Wheel. These are the strict load rating and testing standards that must be passed and certified by the VIA, which is the Japanese Vehicle Inspection Association. So you wanna look for these stamps when you're buying your wheels or choosing wheels for a track setup. So check out apexraceparts.com to see all the different finishes that these wheels come in. I chose to go with the Hyper Silver. It's just something about a nice, clean, bright silver that just looks good. It makes the whole car look pretty classy. Um, I also ceramic coated these wheels and I'm gonna put a tire coating on these too. If you wanna see how that's done, check out my channel, Drive It Ryan. I have a full how-to tutorial on how to do that. Without further ado, let's get these mounted, see how it looks. That's all she wrote, boys and gals. Thank you again to Apex Race Parts for hooking me up with just a perfect setup. Can't wait to see how these feel on the road. I'm gonna go take it for a little drive and recheck re the lug nuts, check the tire pressure, make sure everything's perfect. But man, it's starting to look good. I love that OEM Plus look. So thank you all for tuning in. If you wanna see how I ceramic coated the wheels and how I coated the tires, again, I did a video on that on my own channel, Drive It Ryan, so check that out if you're interested. There's gonna be a lot more content on this car, uh, that car, <laughs> still have it, 
and like I said, lots of stuff coming our way. Check out our website, slipanglemedia.com. Get yourself some, some hoodies, some t-shirts. We're gonna have stickers. We have new designs coming, so should be good stuff. Thanks again for watching, guys. Love you all. Have a good night. Bye.